guys, it's me, Alex, with another updated video for you all today. So, first of all, I just wanted to say happy 2018. We made it through 2017, and that was a crazy, amazing year. And I had so many great memories that I'll never forget ever in my life. And so, now we're into 2018. And I just wanted to address the whole Logan Paul situation that's been going on lately with everyone posting about it. And so here I am addressing it. I know nobody wants to talk about Logan Paul anymore, but it's going viral. And I have to say my opinion about it. First of all, if you don't even know the dude and you never met the dude... And you're just making up a whole bunch of stuff about a person that you have never even met, not even got close to. Then why are you talking like all over social media about him or like all over your YouTube? Like, leave it alone, dude. He's Logan Paul. Like, he can, he does crazy stuff all the time, dude. Like, literally. But I just wanted to address the, um, Japan suicide forest or whatever the heck it was where he went over the weekend and started videoing and all that. He never meant to put the dead body on video, you guys. Like, he was just, like, having a good time. He wanted to see what it was all about. And then he found it and he started recording it. And so... That's not his attention. Like, it was just out of nowhere, dude. Like, don't blame the dude. Like, he was just hanging out with friends, having a good time. And then he found a body and started recording and, like, had it all blacked out or something. But it was not his attention. He didn't mean to. And if he was laughing, you know he already made a video saying he was sorry about it. And then he went on again and did a re-sorry action or a re-sorry video. And he did say he was sorry for doing that. And so it's been addressed to him. And he probably is really sorry. He didn't mean for that to happen. And... It's just, it wasn't in his attention to film that. But, you know, when things happen, you've got to start filming it. And if he was laughing about the whole suicide thing, that's not funny. Because suicide is not the answer, you guys. Like, if you're thinking that, please go get help. There's also a thing where you can Google. It's called the Suicide Hotline, I believe. And if you're struggling with depression, I know I struggle with depression a lot. Um, Go talk to someone about it. Sit down and say, I am going through a really bad time. I have depression. I'm thinking suicidal. I'm, j I just don't know what to do. So please, guys, if you're feeling that way ever, please go talk to someone. You're not alone in the world. Like, you have people that are physically and emotionally there for you, whether it's your grandma, your grandpa, your moms, your dads, your sisters, your brothers, your brother-in-laws, your sister-in-laws, um, your aunts, your uncles, um, cousins, um, anybody whatsoever that you can name off, they are there for you. But Logan Paul didn't mean to videotape the dead body i'm not supposing and me myself i am a little gangster or whatever but please guys don't be hating on the guy that you probably never even met and you're just making up the assumptions and saying he needs to be canceled and he needs to get off and he needs to stop vlogging and he needs to stop this and this and that and then being real to him on Twitter and Instagram and DMing him and, you know, things like that is not funny. Like, going off on Twitter at him, going off on Instagram at him and DMing him, not funny, you guys. Like, he didn't mean to. Like, he, he announced over... Um, Twitter 
and YouTube that he was sorry, and probably Instagram. And so, guys, the Japan suicide force is a really sad thing, and Logan just wanted to go see it and check it out, and he did, and he did not no, he was going to be finding a dead body out there. He wanted to spend 24 hours out there to see if there was any, like, paranormal activity or something out there. But it ended up really bad. So he did call the police and tell them about that body. And so I think... They took it away and took it down and did some investigating, but I'm not really sure. But I did see him on the phone with police and he was um, addressing suicide and how it's not a joke. And then his friend was going on and on about it. And so, please, don't be disrespectful, you guys. Like, don't be saying he needs to cancel his channel and he needs to be off the internet and like all this crazy stuff because that's just nuts like he has billions of trillions of fans that are like literally looking up to him so please dude now if i met logan paul or jake paul or justin bieber or any celebrity i could say any bad thing i want about him because then i would know him and know what he acts like or know what they act like or whatever and you guys don't know Logan Paul, period, probably. He probably doesn't even know you exist. Who knows? He might, he might not. You guys might be friends, you might not. So please, guys, stop the hate, okay? He didn't mean to film it, and he just wanted to see if there's going to be any paranormal activity in that forest. And it ended up really bad. And so that's why there was, like, all this, like footage of the body and like stuff like that and I think the rope was in it I think maybe a little bit I couldn't really see anything but please guys Logan Paul is famous he did take down the video and he did say sorry for it and whoever reposted it or redid it or saved it or whatever please delete it because logan paul did not mean to you all know he didn't and i'm pretty sure he's a great person it's just he made one little mistake and he did go off and delete the whole thing and said sorry to I think his fans or whoever was a part of that and whoever wanted to um whatever but yeah he was on the news and so and on YouTube he said sorry and so it's probably all over the place now but I'm not really sure but anyway guys please Please hit the subscribe button right down here. Hit the notifications, like, and also comment down below 2018. And I will be going through and liking them. So, yeah. Anyway, Logan Paul, I'll always be a little gangster. I'm never leaving your fan base. No matter if you make one little mistake, two little mistakes, three. Like, you can make as many mistakes as you want and I'll still be a little gangster. Like, you're not getting rid of me anytime soon. And I'm going to buy your merch for my birthday. So, I promise I'm never leaving. Like, I will stick up for you. I would do anything for you. Like, you're amazing. And my opinion is just be kind to one another and... Forgive Logan for what he did, and he won't make that mistake again. Because he knows better than that. And so, anyway, guys, I'm out. Thank you so much for over 100 subscribers. Make sure you keep sharing with everybody you know. And from the bottom of my heart, I love you guys. Bye.